With the 2024 MLB playoffs down to the final four teams, the stakes are at an all-time high. Winning the World Series not only means capturing the ultimate prize, but also rewriting the narrative for each team's legacy. Let's break down what a World Series win would mean for each remaining franchise. Starting off, we got the Cleveland Guardians, and the last time the Guardians were even in the World Series, they weren't even known as the Guardians. They were the Indians, and they came off the heel of the Cleveland Cavaliers just coming back from being down 3-1 in the 2016 NBA Finals. Heck, even LeBron was watching some of their games. So what did Cleveland's MLB counterpart do? They did the exact opposite. They were up 3-1 against the Cubs and had an Uno reverse card choke job. Some of the more superstitious fans consider this part of the curse of Rocky Calavito, but that's a different story for a different day. Maybe the curse is lifted with a new team name, or maybe the curse never existed and people are just superstitious. Back to baseball. For the Cleveland Guardians, a 2024 World Series win would erase decades of near misses and heartbreaks. It's been 76 years since their last championship in 1948. Of course, they did come close, especially in 1995 and 1997. Forget about 2016. Their long-standing rivalry with the New York Yankees is a new dimension that we need to start discussing, because it was the Yankees who knocked them out in the postseason in 2017 and 2022. So this rematch adds fuel to the fire. Is three times the charm, or will they have three strikes in and out? Now, under rookie manager Stephen Vogt, Cleveland does have a chance to flip the script. Fun fact about Stephen Vogt, he hit a homer in his first career at bat and and his final career at bat as a player. Vogt's leadership as a manager has been a revelation for this team, guiding the Guardians to an American League Central title through a tough postseason run. Key players like Jose Ramirez and Emmanuel Classe are the forefront for this team, with Ramirez aiming to silence any doubts about his ability to perform in October. Class A, after a rocky start this season, has been lights out in the second half. Winning the World Series this early in his career would cement his place as one of the most dominant closers not just for the Indians slash Guardians, but for the MLB as a whole. A win would also place Vote among the few rookie managers to capture a championship. For a team that prides itself on defense, bullpen strength, and gritty baseball, this title would prove Cleveland's modern approach finally paying off. And oh, look who it is. The evil empire strikes back. We got the New York Yankees. With 27 World Series titles, they aren't strangers to success. But a 2024 championship would carry added significance, since their last title was all the way back in 2009. To put that into perspective, Iron Man 2 didn't even exist since the last time the Yankees won a World Series. And it's been how long the MCU has been dragging? In that meantime, the Bronx Bombers had multiple postseason failures, often at the hands of rival teams like the Houston Astros. And yes, they have been beating on the Guardians in the past few postseasons, but please don't remind me about that. But this current matchup is going to add an oh-so-new chapter for this storied rivalry. As for specific players like, say, Aaron Judge, this could be the crowning achievement of his career if he wins it all this season. While yes, he's already secured his place as the face of the franchise, he didn't really cement himself in the all-time Yankees history. If he played for a bum franchise, he probably would've, but these are the Yankees. No chip, no dip. As for someone like Garrett Cole, after anchoring the pitching staff in another dominant season, this would also silence the critics who questioned his ability to lead the Yankees to a championship. And in this next Guardian vs. Yankees, Yankees matchup, we got a rookie manager versus a veteran manager, someone like Aaron Boone. Another failure would amplify the pressure on him as fans grow restless for the team's next title. A 28th championship would reaffirm the Yankees' place as the premier dynasty team in baseball far outpacing their closest competitors. But sometimes it's not about the money, Spider-Man. It's about the Mets. Let's go Mets. For the Mets, a 2024 World Series win would signal the dawn of a new era in Queens. With just two championships in their history, the Mets spent years living in the Yankees' shadow. This year's Mets have relentless drive battling through injuries and adversity, even with all that still making it to the postseason. Players like Francisco Lindor and Pete Alonso are aiming to make their mark in October. Lindor, the steady leader of the Mets infield, has provided clutch moments throughout the postseason, while Alonso's power has been a game changer. This is also an opportunity if the Mets can get past the Dodgers, a team they battled for National League supremacy 
it would be a statement that they belong in the conversation with baseball's elite. After falling short in 2015, this Mets team feels like one that they can close the deal and bring a championship to City Field. It's also a chance to solidify the Mets as more than just another New York team. They can establish themselves as the New York team. Of course, history will always be on the Yankees' side, but the future can finally be on the Mets' side. No matter what happens, no one can take away for the fact that they won a title in 1969. Nice. And last but not least, you can't catch me dodging this team, it's the Los Angeles Dodgers, and trust me, they are no strangers to October baseball, but another World Series win, especially in 2024, would cement their status as a modern dynasty. Since winning the 2020 World Series, Los Angeles has remained a powerhouse despite dealing with injuries to key players like, say, Clayton Kershaw and Dustin May yet they find themselves once again on the brink of glory. Led by great talent such as Mookie Betts and Freddie Freeman, alongside Shohei Otani, the Dodgers have a pawn lineup that could hang with pretty much anyone. Otani's addition has transformed the team, and this postseason offers a chance for him to shine on baseball's biggest stage. A title would also add to Dave Roberts' legacy as one of the great modern managers, securing his second championship in four years. The Dodgers have faced heartbreak in recent postseasons but a 2024 championship would further separate them from the disappointments of the past. It would also provide some poetic redemption, as they continue their fierce rivalry with the Mets in the NLCS. A victory over New York would reaffirm that the Dodgers are the team to beat in the National League. So here is what a World Series would mean for each remaining team's legacy. Let me know who you think is going to win the World Series and who needs it the most. Don't forget to grand slam that like button and subscribe with notifications turned on. I'm Home Run Rewind, and I'll fast forward to you later.